Hi, it's Ken Hadrick, Dean of the Pi Academy, and welcome to 2014. It's great to see you. I know I've been laying low for a few weeks and it's been a while since you heard from me. But like I always do over the holidays, I like to take a little downtime, uh, reflect on the year that was, and make plans for the coming year. One of my favorite year-end exercises is putting some beef on the bones of my new material for the Pi Academy. Or some chicken, as the case may be. You see, I've been eating so many chicken pot pies lately that I'm about to start clucking. But I've got a wonderful recipe and a video for you for chicken pot pie that's just about under wraps. Not to mention a brand new signature recipe I've been perfecting for a Heath Bar Crunch Pecan Pie. Oh, this thing is good. I'm also working on a bunch of new pie making tool videos including one about scales for weighing your ingredients. Now you may know that from comments that I've made here before that I'm pretty lukewarm when it comes to scales for home bakers. But the good folks at Finisseur, I think that's how you say it, sent me one of theirs and I'm pretty impressed. More about that later. Now I've got another new section of the blog that I'm launching soon and I can't do this one without your help. You know, so many of you have written me in the past to tell me about your favorite pie memories and stories that I've decided to devote an entire section of the blog to them. I'm going to call it Heartwarming Pie Stories. Heartwarming Pie Stories will be your chance to share a little something about your fondest pie memories. Uh, maybe that's an aunt or a grandmother and the way she taught you the secrets of a great crust. Maybe it's an early memory of making pies with your mom or dad when you were a child. Or perhaps you have a berry picking story that's part of your family's uh, berry pie legacy. Whatever the case may be, I want to hear about it. And if you have photos to go with your story, all the better. Anyway, you'll find the submission details below. I'd like to start publishing a few of your stories right here by early February. And I've got a special incentive for you to send me your own heartwarming pie story this month. As I've mentioned here before, uh, my publisher, The Old Farmer's Almanac, is getting ready to release my new Comfort Foods cookbook this fall. Uh, I'll tell you lots more about it as the date approaches. But in the meantime, they were kind enough to send me a box of goodies to help me launch these heartwarming pie stories. There's a beautiful 2014 Old Farmer's Almanac engagement calendar, a 2014 Weather Watchers recipe and gardening calendar, and half a dozen copies of the 2014 edition of the Old Farmer's Almanac, which just happens to include a story by yours truly called A Life of Pi. That's 10 great prizes. Now, if yours is one of the first 10 stories I select for this new section, you'll receive one of these great prizes. Now I'll announce the winners by the end of this month. So, time to dust off your memories and get writing. I'm really excited about this and I hope you are too. Hey listen, it's great to see you back here in the new year and I hope 2014 shapes up to be your best one ever. Thanks for watching today and I'll see you again here soon.